when you made a mistake, you know, it was, it was of course, red is gonna make that mistake, but blue, blue's smart, blue's, blue's intelligent, blue is capable. Red, on the other hand, you know, incapable, incompetent, useless. You know, how do you think after some time period you would feel if that was your treatment every day at school? Not very well. Hate it. Not very well. I hate it. You would hate it. And and let's focus on, you know, how did you get those uh, cards again? Random. Random. Completely random, right? Something that you had no control over. Sure. I don't know what that is. Is that ice water? Okay, let's make sure we don't spill that, right? So, you know, through this process of leading this 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 boycott, uh, the black people of Montgomery, Alabama, decided, okay, if you're not going to let us sit on the bus as equals to any other American, we just won't use your bus system. Okay, so they got together. It was a church community. They got together. They said, all right, like, let's figure out where everyone lives. Let's do some ride sharing. So if one person has a car, maybe they'll pick up two or three other people nearby and they'll figure out how to get everyone to work and how to make this protest work while also not using the bus system. What do you think the city did? They got upset. Lost money. They lost money, right? Started hurting them. So. What the city of Montgomery did was they made a law that was essentially stating that if you're driving with people in your car and you're not a taxi or they're not your family members, I believe, family members, then you get fined. So they said, okay, you want to protest against our bus law? Well, we're going to make it difficult for you to get to work. You, you're not allowed to go in your friend's car. So many people during this protest chose to walk. They would walk five, 10 miles. I mean, we all did the Terry Fox walk. It took us about 45 minutes, nice little stroll. Imagine walking two, three hours to get to school because when you get on the bus, they go, oh, you're a red. Well, the bus is full. We don't have spots for you right now. There's too many blues on the bus. Or you gotta go all the way to the back of the bus because we don't want you to be at the front of the bus. Or better yet, you'll see in the video, there's an example. Um, the teacher says that uh, on the first day, blue eyes students, they can use the water fountain, but the students with brown eyes, they have to fill their water into a paper cup and drink out of that because we wouldn't want, we wouldn't want brown eyed people to, to use the same fountain as blue eyed people, right? Because blue eyed people are so much better, right? Okay, so I'm gonna show you a video about Martin Luther King Jr. It's gonna give you a little idea and then we'll move on and we'll watch this experiment that they did, um, or this lesson actually, that turned into an experiment. <laughs> 